All right, guys, what's going on? It is uh, Tuesday, January 23rd. Wait, 15th. Huh. And this is how we're going to start off January 23rd. Charlottetown Police Services. As the registered owner of this vehicle, you are responsible for parking violations issued by the city. An out-of-court settlement can be made. Payments made. Wow. I am in trouble. I have never been in trouble, but apparently I'm in trouble. Like, you know, that sucks. But yeah, January 23rd, kick off of the vlog, weekly vlog, or daily, I don't know. It might change, it could be like, today could be one, and then tomorrow there might not be one, and then on Sunday there could be one. I don't know, I'm just going to try to do it. I think it's going to be fun. I'm super pumped. I got this new gear, I got this mic, this Rode mic that you're listening to me through. It is so nice, I'm really liking it. Uh, I got this nice tripod set up, I'm feeling like... A pro and I'm not even a pro shout out to one person who's definitely probably not gonna see this video this one person definitely made me really consider just vlogging in general because they were like you know it's just something cool to do and if you do it it doesn't matter what you're doing it just matters that you're happy doing it and that one person is Casey Neistat that guy if you do not know who he is go on YouTube and type in Casey Neistat and watch his videos they are absolutely incredible the guy has so many cool things going on all the time he's a crazy cool filmmaker and he made it and he just has a lot of good life views to like share with the world um, so really go check him out because that's that's why I'm doing this because that guy was the coolest and he literally put out a video the other day and the video was titled do what you can't and he said you know what it doesn't matter any anymore no one knows anything about today's world which is really crazy no one knows a single thing like nothing it's so new like today it's a new world you can do whatever you want and his mentality was no one knows anything so don't let anyone stop you from doing something because nobody knows if it's going to work out or not and like that's when i was like you know what that's what i'm gonna do it is january 23rd now let's start the day do you feel the Another super crazy fun fact, I did all of that for you guys, so I was trying to make this room look cool for YouTube, so it's a huge thing I did for, I, ne I would never do that, ever, it took a lot of work to put all those t-shirts up there, you know how many thumbtacks are in there, you know how many thumbtacks are on the floor right now, you know how many times I'm going to step on the floor in the middle of the night and step on a thumbtack, exactly, dedication, like and subscribe. We have, we have a dog, Bear. I'm gonna let him out in a second. We have this little cube, and the cube, that's my dad's girlfriend, Morgan, watch the dog from work so she can like Skype in and be like, hey! And it's so funny because sometimes now I come home and I can just talk to it. So that's what I was just doing. I gotta let the dog out. Hey everybody, this is Bear. This is the cute dog in the channel forever. You are so hyper today. <gasps> But it's snowing outside. I don't want to be out here when it's snowing. Come on in. So they just canceled schools. Also, very rarely will you see me eat breakfast. I don't know if like, you'll see me really eat. That's crazy. Maybe you'll think I'm a superhuman. Breakfast ain't my thing, but lunch is my thing. You know what? I just think we get in my car and we go to school. Um, yeah, so. Welcome home, I guess is the best. <laughs> uh, someone take me away from this place for the rest of my life. <laughs> I am in love with this tripod. Like, you're just sitting there on the seat. You could fall though. It'd be devastating if you fell. Canada! What? We could be stuck. What? We ain't. The jet is pulling through.
Okay, so one thing you do got to know, especially if you're not from here at all, uh, not from PEI, we'll get to that topic because that's a whole different ball game. But if you're from like not Canada or a place where it's just generally not snowy, the one problem with a day like today is yesterday the roads were clear, but today they're a little icy, slushy, all the fun stuff. So people forget that whenever you turn, if you turn and crank your wheel too hard, you will go sideways. And if you stop and you just put your foot right on the brake, you just put your foot right on the brake, it's over. Okay team, so we made it to the college. I am positive that I just didn't get the memo and that they're closing it right now. I'm almost positive because it is, you know, I don't think you can see it that because the exposure is totally wrong. Um, but it is snowing like crazy. But anyways, I'm gonna make my way into the classroom. Next time you see me, we are going to be at my desk. Uh, this is the room that I spend most of my life in. It's kind of like prison in a way. I spend, actually, you know what? I get a lot of breaks. I leave all the time. I'm never here. I always work from home at the desk you guys saw earlier. I love this setup though. It's pretty like, it's so weird though. Cause it's like, some people use those tiny ones and I'm just like, no, this camera's huge. Woo. Yeah, like full time on the spot, going at it hardcore. Eh? Eh? Just like all. Oh. Eh? What's up, boss? How you doing? Is that? Yeah, that's pretty much. Hello. Okay. In this department, we do everything. We do like all the pictures of these walls. A few rooms that you need to know about. It's black and white film, and then in here, lights. There is a product studio. Super cool. We do some product work over there. I'm really in here because I like to like do portrait work. Portrait work's my thing. This is the, the first year lab, so like if you're in the program and you're first year, then we keep we keep you in here. I was in here last year. It's like a it's like a general rule. You gotta stay in there. Okay, so today is kind of like one of those days that I have a problem with because I hate when school gets canceled on a snow day because I have so much work to do. Like I like to be able to just stay in the building and all that stuff. But I mean, speaking from a Canadian standpoint, I guess it's going to be bad. Like they just put out this report and they're saying, you know, freezing rain is expected. Due to deteriorating road conditions, the RCMP are advising people to stay off the roads. So that means that we just got here about 30 minutes ago. Actually, no, 45 an hour. Now we gotta go home. I think we're all closed down, my man. Where are they? Yeah, 12.30, we're shut down completely. Super Canadian though, right? Yeah. Stay in there, hold the door for a few seconds. That's what you want to see. You know what, it is freezing rain right now. This all hurts. I am not say it hurts, but it doesn't feel nice. Oh my stars, the wind's blowing in my face. It's like, I would go as far to say, this is like a blizzard. Wow, and then look at the whip. Look at the Jetta, all ready to go. Let's get inside. Oh. Also, right now, favorite song, <clears throat> just to keep track for my personal goodness, is uh, From Now On from The Greatest Showman. If you don't like The Greatest Showman, just, I don't know. Distraction, turning you off. Okay, so we had to get a few things. Um, let me just, the main thing I needed was one of these. It's I lost my, somehow I, why is this so close? Oh, I lost my battery charger for my camera. And it was really disappointing because without the battery charger, I can't charge the camera. Um, but now since it's a snow day, snow day requires two things, blankets and usually chips. Now the problem with that statement is I don't have chips and I can't justify paying for chips when Domino's has a $9 pizza. My favorite pizza, chicken, bacon, barbecue, barbecue feast pizza, best one. I'm gonna go get some pizza. This place is upgraded, like look, I'm the only one in here. Like, this is pretty cool. I think it's the coolest. We've got this little, little board. It's like, whose order's next? And mine, and then it's like a countdown. It's like, the order's gonna be ready in like six minutes. That's nuts. And it's so futuristic. It's pretty crazy. I like that. See now, like, 
This is just perfect. I got a snow day. Well, like it's not perfect, but it's perfectly unperfectly perfect. Oh, oh, oh. Like the best, like the best. So like, I did want to do a lot of work today, but like, I think that everything happens for a reason. And I think that today, Mother Nature decided that I was not supposed to do anything but eat this pizza and watch Netflix. So we're gonna roll with that note. And uh, I think I'm supposed to go to the movies later or something. I don't know. But I guess I got you guys to keep me somewhat entertained. So see you in a little. Okay, so snow day 101. Gonna build a train track today with this guy. We're building a train track today. And yeah, baby, it's gonna be awesome. Woo! Lots of excitement around here. Like a ton of excitement. Okay, where can I put you so you can watch? Tell me a little bit about this train track that we got here. Whoa. Want to turn on the cars and let everybody see how it all works? Okay, you push the buttons. So it is all quiet around here. Parker and me are downstairs. I'm gonna make grilled cheese sandwiches. I think I'm still going to the movies, maybe. What do you think, Bear? Hmm? What? What's going on? What? You miss, like, what's going on today? Got anything to say? Nothing. Bear's having a little bit of anxiety right now because people are leaving the house and he's sticking around and can't go. So I'm gonna go downstairs and he's probably maybe gonna be upset with me. But oh well. <sighs> Just had a wicked awesome nap. Got home from this snow day, monsoon, rainstorm. Did some work, ate that pizza. Oh, was that ever good? Built that train track. Train track was unreal. Five minutes later, Parker decided to go and like try to fix it and he broke the whole thing. He was all sad, so we had to fix that up. After that, he laid down and was watching Mordecai, which is like this movie with Johnny Depp in it. it was, I thought it was interesting. So I watched that. Yeah, I kind of, I guess I kind of like fell asleep, really dozed off, like, I don't, that, I don't know. Woke up maybe, I don't know, an hour ago, 6.30, where does time go? Now I'm just kind of chilling here, playing some Fortnite, uh, and I think Andre's coming over here soon, and then we're heading to the movies, and then I think we're going to go see 12 Strong or The Commuter. So yeah, that's kind of the plan, and then I guess we'll see where the night takes us, but I mean, it's 7.30. Vlog one is almost complete. Pretty pumped, I guess, yeah. What's up, everybody? So uh, it's now 12.08. So today's vlog really carrying through the next day. Started January 23rd, now it's the 24th. Uh, so to conclude today, today was a pretty cool day. I mean, what did we do that was very interesting? Not a whole lot. I uh, woke up, started the day off, built some train tracks. Today was a snow day, so Got some train tracks built, spent some time with Parker, it was awesome. He wants to put a bunch of train tracks on YouTube, so YouTube be ready for some wicked awesome Thomas the Train stuff coming your way soon. Then Andre came over, we hung out, just chilled, we're waiting for some other people, and then Andre, myself, I guess I should say, because people are gonna definitely correct me, Andre, Ali, Sabrina, Brooklyn, and I, there you go, Mom, uh, we all went to see uh, 12 Strong, which is in theaters. Uh, obviously I'm not paid to say this because I have like nine subscribers. If you are looking to go see a really good movie, I thought it was super fantastic. Uh, it's based and told on a true story. Uh, 12 Strong for those of you who don't know. It's about 12 American soldiers who got inserted into Afghanistan uh, to basically take down the Taliban after 9-11 occurred. So super good movie. Really heartfelt. Hugs on the strings a little bit. Brooklyn cried. It was... I saw it coming. But yeah, if you're looking for a good movie, lots of action. Uh, true story, great acting, uh, it's, it's definitely one for the books. So yeah, I guess that concludes the first day, so we're gonna get to work kinda soon, I guess, and 
you know, edit this up, throw it on the internet, and see uh, if anybody enjoys it, I guess. That's all I got. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Cheers.